Hello everyone and welcome back to some more of the long journey home. Speaking of our long journey home, we're on it right now. Can you imagine? What a coincidence. Uh, we're a bit low on fuel at the moment. Exotic matter fuel that is. Our hull's a bit battered, but we've got some trade goods in the uh, resource bay here. We've got some, uh, some more gold. We've still got plenty of carbonate, so we can refuel a bit more. And we are heading to a specific system, or rather a cluster, that will have a lot of asteroids in it. So we should be able to refuel in space. At the risk of running out of regular fuel, so that will be interesting. Yeah, we're just gonna go, keep going to this starbase over here. I don't think we've been there yet. Pretty sure we haven't. I'd go to these planets, but they're all rock planets, and I'm pretty sure we still have... Yeah, no yield on rock planets, and extra heat damage. But the ship's fine now, so that's nice. We're gonna be able to do a lot more with that. So yeah, we're just coasting along, trying to sell the things we have. Trying to make a bit of money on the side. You should be able to get us a new system. Oh, I think we will have to bargain a bit for money. Just because that's how it is. Hello. So nice that we, that we spawned so close there. Ah, yes, the Grucks. Services. You've got uh, a shop. You can sell us things. Not bad. We can repair things, although... Eh, 75 credits. We currently have 56 credits. Yeah, we need 81. Come on, man. You're... There we go. Those guys are... Very, uh... No. No, it's not worth it. It's just not worth it, my dude. No. Right, let's just get out of here then. Bye, Grux. You greedy little bastards. I know we don't have to use these yet, but it's probably not a bad idea to fix the ship up a little bit. And make sure we can take at least one more jump. We're now out of resources, completely. But we should be able to refuel from asteroids, uh, or rather repair and stuff from asteroids, so... It'll be fine. Hopefully. Maybe. Again, it's a very nice gate, but it... not sure how it works. Then again, alien technology. There's so much here that we don't know how it works. Yay! Things are breaking. And now we're in a hostile place. Okay. We've got to be a bit careful. I say hostile because these pulsars are not very nice. Let's see, we've got a gas giant over there. Probably going to be Inferno or something like that. We can try checking out the other planets. If there's no crazy radiation pulses. Uh, let's also check the new damage that we just took. Atmosphere scan is unavailable. Guess that's alright. Could have been worse. Of all the things, you know. Hopefully this is going to get us into an orbit. I doubt it somehow. Maybe let's do a bit more course adjustment. You know... Relative position. We might be able to make it now. Yeah, there we go. That's better. Ooh, look at you. Red rings and everything. Very sexy. Alright. There we go. We don't have the temperature, convection, or atmosphere. Okay, so that might be a bit of a problem.
If we can get a bit of gas, though, that would be really good for us. So I'm going to take the risk, despite, you know, not knowing what we're going into. The re my argument being, it's probably going to pay off. Doesn't seem to be too bad. More confection, we've got arctic temperatures, oh. Alright then. So the only thing being rough here is the... Uh, the gravity. Alright, this is what we're looking for. There we go. Rare resource for the win. Got some chlorines over here as well. We're just gonna go to the left here. See if we can get some more resources that way. Got some helium abound. Ooh, more chlorine. Yep, we'll try and get that. Nice. Oh, hell yeah, we're getting a lot of goodies from here today. Yes, please. Oh. Uh, let's try and... Can we double dip? I don't think we can double dip. Going for the rare resource first, then. Yeah! Right, let's get out of here before we damage the lander too much. That was a crazy good haul. Holy crap. Can we like, scoop something on the way out? Nah, let's just go. Let's just go. That was amazing. That is gonna get us through a lot of systems here. That's really good. Wow. Totally worth it. Thank you. I appreciate it. So now we've got a bit of helium. We've got some chlorine and we've got krypton. That is like one full tank of gas almost. Oh, that is really good. And we've got an encounter thing over there as well. Oh no, wait, that's the other... No, that's not the other thing, is it? No. Such fascinating creatures, these entropy. Efficient. Industrious. Free from anger and prejudice. The perfect scientific life form. Don't color them too much. Can we get a, uh, can we get a look at the new gal, uh, you know, the little, su the surroundings we're in, basically. Wow. Could have phrased that a lot better. Alright, we've got mineral mining over there, interesting. Plants over there, the plants hate us. And we've got, uh, religious transports over here, okay, that's gonna get us within two clusters of Earth. Ooh. Uh, we'll probably jump to Nakanoshima, because it's got asteroids and things, so we should be able to maybe get some jump fuel there. There's a yellow dwarf. This is a red giant, so dipping for fuel would be a bit more risky. We could make a jump to a yellow dwarf here, or like... A I'm not sure if there are any white dwarfs, so... Eh, we're getting a bit... We're getting into some risky territory, not gonna lie. But yeah, it's good to have a bit of a look around. We'll probably go to Nakanoshima and just see what is up. We'll see if we can find some jump fuel on the planets here that we can actually dock with. Just do a bit of burning. There we go. Honestly? Yeah, I could use a bit of aluminum. We might be able to sell it for a little bit. We might be able to use it to fix the hull. You know, when in doubt, fix the hull. Average gravity is not going to be any problem. We will have to watch the hull right now, though. There's the aluminum. Excellent. Wrong convection's from the left. Alright, we're going to have to do a bit of burning, apparently. 
Right, let's just slide in. Right, there we go. Transmission clutch is slipping, that's great. Just what I needed. We'll go check out the other deposit because that that almost felt like it was the rare the the common resource. Nope, that's copper, right there. It is in fact. We did get three of the uncommon, so that's really good. Thank you. Fill me up, Scotty! Gimme. We squeeze in one more? Yeah, okay, let's go. I don't want to damage the lander too much with those explosions. The deeper you go, the more chance of explosions there is. But there we go, not bad. That's gonna help us fix our hull. You know, I had a bad feeling about this episode. It's actually looking pretty darn good right about now. Let's go check out the purple thing. And we'll head to the ship in the meanwhile. We have a lot of resources now. Uh, what? We didn't do anything. Right? We'll put two copper into the hull of the lander, two in the ship. We still have those repair kits as well, so if we get into a bind here, we can just fix it. And that's really good. I approve. Let's see, uh, we've got ships not really caring about us in specific, that's good. Probably Grugs Reclaimers and we don't have any outstanding debt because we refuse to dock with their star bases. Because they pay an exorbitant fee. Let's see, I'm curious to see what we'll find, maybe a wreck, maybe something else. I'm glad we don't have to worry about fuel at the moment. We'll go through the common resources first. If we can sell the Kronon or whatnot, uh, or uh, whatever the hell it is. Krypton. Krypton. Sure. If we can sell that, you know, we might be able to afford a full refill instead, which is more efficient. Right. This might come back to bite us. I'm not quite sure. We'll find out. Ah, there we go. Uh, could we... Uh, Lander. Could he... Could we maybe have Kirsten take point here? Boarded wreck. No sign of life. Seems stable. Continue exploring? Yep. This looks like a bunk and a lot of boxes laying around. And a thing that looks like a desk. Here's something. Should we bring it? Oh, it's a reclaimer's list. Might be useful. So that's a Grux item. Interesting. We might have to intercept one of them and be like, hey, what is this? Oh, this killed our velocity, basically. Uh, can we look at it? These are coordinates, I'm sure. Should I try to find out more? See, this is why we're so... This is why you're so useful. You're so... Multi-sided. Rare resources found. Planet Anastroda. Huh. In the Wishing Well Cluster? Isn't that like one back? Didn't we already go there once? Oh no, we're still there. Okay. Fair enough. So where is that then? No idea! No idea. Right, well, fair enough. Oh, FL for Genus. Right, I am an idiot. Ah, there we go. You've got the Krypton and stuff. That's good. Krypton's useful. I guess. 
So we're gonna do just a slight burn. I wanna go to that jungle planet, I think it is. That's probably got the silicates. If we get some silicates, you know, we'll be in a way better position. As long as, as it's not the rock planet. That is uh, basically what we're hoping for. If it's the rock planet, we're kind of in trouble. How are we doing for resources? We've still got three aluminum. So we can fix the ship up nicely in a bind. Or the lander. We, we still have those kits, don't we? Oh yeah, you repair devices. Let's try that. We fixed the lander drill. Ooh. Alright then. So we can go to rock planets again. That's good. You look like an infected planet. Hello, Harold. I'm actually going to see if you want to trade. If I can sell you something, that would be nice. And, you know, we might get converted. Oh, you're a small ship. Hello, people. We believe our previous emissaries failed to give you a copy of the Changing Word. It is our testament, ever rewritten as we discover more of your part of the galaxy. Sure, I'll take it. Blessings of the truth be upon you. It is said that the truth will lead us to what we seek. May it do the same for you. Alright, these guys like to trade. They want to take one Krypton for 64, really? Man! Holy crap, you guys wanted a really big deal there. This is good! Yeah! Look at that! Wow! Uh, can I show you the reclaimers list? Okay. Okay. Uh, goodbye, and thank you very much! I'll take the parting blessing! You have blessed my wallet, I will dip into your religion slightly, I guess. Man, that's really useful. Told you we'd hang on to those for a good reason. Yeah, thanks a lot, Mr. Uh, crazy Religion. That's gonna be like two fill refills instead of, you know, like 20 or 30% in a bind. There we go, we barely managed to squeeze it in. There's ruins over here. I'm gonna check it out because there is a bit of fuel here. And you know, fuel is nice. We're gonna need fuel. We'll, we'll have to go check out the rock planet, I'm afraid. All right. Let us go and find out then. There's some helium. Risky maneuvers are involved. There we go. Just get three. Just because we've we're, we've got another common, right? We're just gonna go over there instead and be like, "Yeah, you give me all your things now." Let's quickly uh, get in here while we're here. There we go. Getting better at this. We found Sakindi ruins. Landing complete. I'm standing by what looks like a natural cave network. Except that the walls are ribbed. Might have been carved out with... I'm thinking acid. A beacon outside is broadcasting a message on a loop. Sakindi. Warning. Sakindi. Warning. Well, we don't take kindly to warnings. Oh god. Maggots in a hole. Giant maggots everywhere. They're brushing against my suit and... Ugh, I might be sick. I'm on a cliff, down below. It's like a fighting pit. Several man-sized ants covered in chitinous armor with blades for limbs are battling slowly to death. The sides are piled up with what remains of losers, slowly decomposing. They tear me to pieces. So I think you found critter repellent? We don't have it, I think. Oh, we do. Ow! Well, yeah, use it. 
Are you sure? They're bugs, but big, big bugs. I'm not gonna send you after sword bugs, you know. If I have something against it, I will use it. The Emperor protects. Stay wary of the Xenos. Uh, man, such heresy. Fine, giving it a try. Covering myself in the stuff, and here we go. Climbing down slowly. I think it's working. They're completely ignoring me. I don't want to push my luck, but I'm going to see if I can find anything down here. Not sure what these are. They look organic. Could be worth investigating. Is it kindy samples? Sure, let's get the hell out of there, yeah. You know it. So, we are uh, vulnerable to being uh, visited by the Inquisition now for a her heresy with Xenos. But aside from that, yeah, good stuff. Let's get out of here. We've got a bit of fuel, so that's going to keep us traveling through the stars a bit longer. I approve. And, you know, since we apparently managed to sell our fuel for a million space bucks, almost. We're in a good position here. I like it. Last up, the rock planets, because, well, I'm pretty sure that's where the silicates are hiding. And I do want to have a bit more exotic matter stocked up. Just to make sure that uh, things go alright. You know, I need at least one jump worth to get to the asteroids. Oh, Glux Reclaimer, get over here! Sir? Sir? Hello? I was pinging you, he was not listening. Very rude. I hit Q multiple times, he just did not want to interact. Alright then, we won't return his list. Alright, let's get an orbit. There you go. High gravity, probably very hot. It is, uh, it's a rock planet. With structures as well. Uh, resources. Should we use the chlorine? I think we'll use the chlorine. Although, helium's also pretty, uh... Helium's not worth that much. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll go land quickly. There are ruins here that we can check out. And we'll be able to get, like, at, le at least three silicates, which ought to be enough for one more jump. Ooh, nice sound. Uh, searing temperatures. Oh, God. I think we'll just bail, to be honest, and not check out the ruins. Oh, look at that landing, though. Three-pointer. Yep, let's just go. I don't care about your ruins, mate. I need to get out before we all die. This will at least give us a bit more margin of error with the jumping, so that's good. Speaking of jumping, let's get out of here. Got places to be, you know? And we go to Nakanoshima. We're getting close to Earth. Down below 25,000 parsecs. We gotta try not to find any plants. They'll try and turn us into a salad. Guess it's too late to keep a low profile, huh? Yep. We've got hydrogen. I don't have any, like, things that I really want to stop for. We've got strange, enemy re uh, strange energy readings. Not enemy readings, thank god. Uh, looks like we have a friend about to intercept us. They might ask us for something, who knows. Oh, it's the energy ship, right. I know you. Strange energy reading. Binary. 
I'm not gonna cheat by like looking up a, a, a translator. If anyone wants to go and translate this for me, you know. I wouldn't be alright to reading it in the comments, but I'm not gonna do it myself. Can I show you the Zakindi samples? Since ouch, more glance and hyena lion winked. Hey. How about, uh. Can I ask you about self? Far immorally oversaw that ouch perfectly after emu. Far at that hazily customarily more about beheld frequently. Oh, left. You know what? Let's just end this. Angrily Abyss, Totem Jericho! Angrily Abyss, Totem Jericho! It really likes a Jericho, apparently. I wanna see the things it gave. Oh, oh, it's not boost. You know what, the other resource is never going to get caught, it just flung off. We'll go see what this one is, since it's not flying at hyperspeed. Wow! Okay! It's like, yeah, we'll just drop you a million sil silicates. And I think we can, like... We're better off just leaving. No way in hell we're gonna catch that other rock, but that's like four silicates, holy crap. I'm glad I blew the crap out of it. Jeez. I mean, that works, you know. At least we can leave a good first impression. Exactly, you know. Might be too late to get out, but that's fine. Oh, that's a pirate. That's a big one. Let's try and not mess with him, then. Though I think we might have paid him off. At least we paid off one of his cousins, so... I'm not sure if that's gonna do. But we'll find out, I guess. I would like to find a starbase soon. I think we can find one in the next jump area, so that would be nice. You know. Make sure that we can actually uh, refuel. Because we've got credits now. And we've still got some more Krypton we can bargain with as well. I'm starting to feel like we might actually make it home this time. Which is weird. Just gonna be very gentle. Don't want these to fly off into the rocks. Carbonates! Lovely. That's gonna help us get home. I mean, they're only common, but still, I'll take them. There you go. Yeah, I was afraid of that. Well, it's fine. We use the carbonates. I get silicates! Ah, ha, ah, ah. You know me too well, game. You know me too well. Uh, is there anything? No. Short answer? No. Just bail. Get out. That pirate was gunning for us as well. We got out just in the nick of time there. I like it. You guys have mineral mining over there. Uh, merchants, restock, repair, and a shipyard. These guys like us, and we only pay 75 to get over there. If they have a jump gate over here... Ooh. We're actually getting close to Earth. I like it. We'll be able to get some fuel from there. We might have to pay those 50 extra credits, which is gonna suck. We'll try and show them that list. God help me. I can no longer work without Malcolm's infernal metal music. Very well, Captain. Let rakes hit buckets in the name of rhythm. <laughs> I 
I like his attitude, you know. Uh, we're probably going to end the episode in orbit around this planet, though. It's because, well... It's about that time, you know. High gravity. It's an Arctic world. I'm not going to worry about temperature. I think we can agree that is a big... Uh, that is not a big deal. But anyway, that will be it for this episode. We're actually getting sort of close to Earth again. It's great. Let's see, open the galaxy view real quick. Just have a bit of a look. We're one jump away from getting to a new cluster. IRAS 05437. Many rock planets. We didn't get as much fuel here as I thought we would, but we can still get some borates and stuff, so that's cool. And then it's off to either of these. And then we're going to have to go through this small but rough cluster. And then we can go home. You know. We're currently 24,000 parsecs away. I think next episode is going to be the defining episode where we either find out will we make it or will we get murdered. It's looking pretty good right now. So thank you all for watching another episode. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a comment and perhaps a like as well, you know, if you enjoyed the video. It helps me a lot, helps the channel a lot, lets me know you want to see more of the long journey home. Subscribe if you'd like to see more, and I will catch you all next time. Until then, have a good one, folks.